right. All these white people celebrating down here and black people suffering on the other side of the tracks. That's what's happening right now. You donated to Katrina victims? Excuse me? Have you donated any Katrina victims? Huh? Yes. Do you know right now there's still black people on the other side of the tracks over there suffering right now, man? There are babies that don't have nowhere to live. I don't care about the green light. Nobody cared about the green light when black people was trying to get up out of here. And the white are celebrating, dancing on huh? African culture. That's what's going on right now. So we still see that most of white America doesn't care about Katrina. Doesn't care about black people, don't have nowhere to go, just across the tracks over there. That's right. So now we have the proof. Most of white America does not care about black people who are still suffering. Dancing on French. That's what it looks like. You're celebrating, you're drinking, you're smoking, what you've been doing all your life since black people have been slaves in America. So now we have more proof. I have never in my life seen anything like I saw in the city of New Orleans. I talked to a police officer that will be renamed Nameless last night. He told me personally, he went in to rescue people. And this is a law enforcement officer. He said he seen black boats, something with like the Navy SEALs use. Now when he they came in, the, he said he seen a guy in a full Navy suit come up out the water and told the deputies to cut their engines off. Told them to be quiet. So when he said that, he went back under the water, they went back outside, and five minutes later they heard gunshots. The United States government used Katrina to come in here and start training their soldiers to kill, and was using our people to do this. So Katrina was a training ground for the United States military. We've also talked to other people that were in the military who at a checkpoint, I would rename names, that said that the police officers were told by the sheriff's deputy to put on all black and go up into the neighborhoods and cause chaos. So they use trigger time. They actually got actual training down here. This is not, when you do an urban uh, martial law or military, you have to be able to train your soldiers in an urban environment and a realistic environment. But that what I told you earlier about the guy coming up out the water, they're showing you that they actually had people down here killing our people for real time training exercise.